Hello, today we're going to have a game of Star Commando for the Amstrad CPC and this is basically a space simulator type game um, as we log in as my name, yes Pilot of Arcade, I could never understand what the difference is, we just put Pilot so basically what we've got to do is clear all these um, pick something that goes into warp drive automatically and take you to your first mission here we go, so here we go. Graphics are not pleasant, um, to be honest with you. This ain't a fucking good game at all, to be honest with you. Um, I did review this before, but I think the audio was a bit shitty, so I'm redoing it. Um, this was part of a four pack Amsoft pack, one of many that I used to have back in the day. Um, this was one of the games that come with the four pack of Amsoft games, not the ones that come with the Amsoft CPC, but it was like a gift pack back in the day, with four Amsoft packs, games on the pack. Anyway, get into the back of the game, so basically what you got to do is shoot all these other spaceships that are trying to kill you. Mm. So, it ain't a brilliant game. It's alright, but it ain't brilliant. Graphics, I say, the graphics are a bit crappy. Um, done in mode one. Um, very slow and sluggish, to be honest with you. Um, so we got a power. We got to run out of power. Um, oh, so when you, I think when you get over to a certain amount of um, points or certain amount of ships, it goes straight to a warp drive, and then you go back to this screen here. So what can we pick now? No data available. All right, we'll go to. Is that Stellar Invaders? Oh, well, if you leave it, we'll play some music and we'll go to Stellar Artois. No, that's a drink, isn't it? Probably more lethal. No, I'm joking. Here we go. These are the Stellar Invaders. Um, okay, <laughs> enough said, really. Um, mm, so basically, I'm very disappointed there's no effects where you can where there's a firing effect, it just makes the crosshair turns turns the crosshair red basically, that's it. Nothing really spectacular about the game. Um, so it gives you the power. Oh, I should be looking at the screen really. Oh, and I don't know. Perhaps it gets to a certain amount of points or... I don't really know why it goes into warp drive. Because it just does it automatically. Um, so what do we have here? Let's go down to meteor shower. Um, basically, they don't fire back. You're just shooting at meteors, meteorites, or whatever. Um, here we go. See, so yeah, it's a nice, colourful level with the meteorites, um, asteroids, whatever. <laughs> yeah, I've played better, much better flight simulator, space simulators on the Amstrad. While then being codenamed Matt. Um, that was an Amsoft title and that was a very good game to be honest with you. I've done a review on that. Um, I'd say that was one of the best. I would say one of the best Amsoft titles I had actually. Um, not the best, one of the best. <laughs> this, well, this was just crap. <laughs> you play, if you want to play a space simulator, play codenamed Matt by Ams Amsoft. Or the legendary Elite. I've never played that game, of course, Elite. Um, well, perhaps I should. Here we go, so we're back to this screen once again. Space Mines. Well, that's interesting. Space Mines, okay. So we've got to watch out for them bastards, I think. Here we go. Mm, graphics looks like a fucking palette. Paint palette or something. <laughs> Don't know what that's all about. Well, they represent mines, I suppose. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I can see a little. Yeah. All right. Whatever. Yeah. Graphics are very primitive. The Amstrad was capable of much more than that. <laughs> um. But I suppose it was just a silly little Amsoft title. Um. So it was back in '84. I suppose it was all right. I suppose. But I've seen much better games in 84. <laughs> um, 
I actually got the Android TPC in 85. Um, but yeah, even then, the games that come with the Amstrad, a lot of them were much better than this. Um, sound effects, I suppose they could have been better, but I suppose that for the time they're all right. Um, enough said, really. I can't really think of something, anything else to say. You just blast the shit out of these things, and that's it. To say, I've never done the pilot. I'm in pilot mode, but I don't know what arcade mode is all about. Here we go, warp drive. You can move the joystick if you want. Um, you can control it. Don't know if it does anything, but it's interesting, right? We've got the mothership. So what the mothership does, you can regain energy. That's what the mothership is. So I'm down on power, 300. So I could be dying any time soon. So if you get, basically, you've got to get this really in line. And then your power starts going up, but it's fucking hard. Um, oh, fucking, I'm so close and it ain't doing nothing. Come on, running out of power here. Fucking hell, look at it. Oh, come on, this is fucking hard. Ah, oh, here we go. Goes beep and changes colour, and your and energy's gone up to 500 odd. So if you keep doing that, if you're that clever, you can make your power go right up. And you fucking will need it and all. Ah, oh, it's fucking already gone into warp drive. Right out loud. Mm, so what we got left? Galactic pirates. I think we'll do that. <laughs> if things don't get any worse, then we got galactic pirates. Fuck it out. <laughs> so here we go. Ooh. Here we go. Look like 3D Tie Fighters from Star Wars. <laughs> <laughs> the game can get any worse now they start ripping off Star Wars. <laughs> they did in Codename Matt actually. Use the TIE Fighters. Um, but I obviously thought they looked better <laughs> in, in Codename Matt. Um, anyway, I suppose. From a game for on a pack, I suppose it can, it's alright, it's done. It was all wall shooting. Ball just going red, we could die, we're gonna die because our power's right down. Oh fucking hell, we're gonna die. Oh, I'm gonna think, thank fuck for this because I've had enough of this. Yay, it's game over. Oh fucking hell. So we come top the queue. Okay, as so I'm gonna end this review now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time. And goodbye!